students so next i'm going to solve the six number problem the problem is very interesting once you see the problem a circular park of radius 20 meter is situated in a column okay three boys ankur chhed and david are sitting at equal distance on its boundary each having a toy telephone in his hands to talk to each other okay find the length of the string of each phone okay so first of all one circular park first you see uh, draw a circular park that means it is a circle no okay suppose uh, not like this circular park so say this one is the circular park so three students uh, are sitting ankur shet and david okay at equal distance and distance means always shortage distance not the uh, curved distance like this so i am taking here a uh, suppose here b and here c okay so a b and c so these are the distance equal distance that means abc is an equilateral triangle okay so abc is an equilateral triangle okay So we have to find out the length of each string means A B or B C or uh, C A like this. That means side of the equilateral triangle. And what is given? The radius of this circular park is 20 meter. That means suppose this O A. This O A here O A is 20 meter. It is given. Okay. So to solve this problem, one important concept required. That you see, for any triangle, no, for any triangle, uh, if you draw a line through a vertex and the um, midpoint of the opposite sign, that means the median, all the median intersect at a point, no, and the uh, ratio is two is to one. So, if I draw this side, this side, and that side also. They will intersect at O, all these three medians, and this point is called the centroid or uh, uh, centroid of this triangle. No, so the ratio is two is to one means if I complete this one, no, like this. If I complete this, if I complete this, no need to draw. Complete this, then this would be two, and this one will be one. One, two, two, one, like this. That means two is to one. Ratio is two is to one. So. Now you see, this, suppose this one, this one is, I am giving here D. AD is the height of the equilateral triangle or not? First you tell me. Obviously. So we know the formula for height of the equilateral triangle. If you forget, then if you use the Pythagoras theorem for triangle ABD, then also you will get. So as we know, so AD equal to what? Uh, root 3 by 2 into side a a is the i am taking this side suppose a so if this one is a this one also a this one also a side of the equilateral triangle so ad is this one okay and moreover if see uh, this full length is this one okay now oa is given or not this OA is given 20, but if I find out uh, this OA by using the property that 2 is to 1, then what will be this OA? Okay, so again, you see here, again, this OA equal to 2 by 3 into AB is not it, because you see, 2 is to 1, so full is 2 plus 1, 3, that's why 3, and then 2 by 3 of a a d length so what is the value of a o a is given o a is given 20 okay 2 by 3 a d means what root 3 by 2 into a a you have to find out from here okay so 2 2 that means 10 so um, 10 into 6 root 3 a okay so a equal to 
10 into 6 by root 3. Rationalize it. Root 3 by 3. Root 3. So 3, 3, 3. If you get cancel, 20 root 3. So A equal to this uh, middle. Understood? See, again I am going to explain this one because this is very important and interesting also. So for any triangle, we have one result. The result is that for any triangle, okay, for any triangle, what result we have? This is the median, this is also the median, this is also the median. Now, so this ratio, they will intersect at a point. So this ratio is 2 is to 1 every day. Okay, 2 is to 1, 2 is to 1, 2 is to 1, 2 is to 1, like that. Just to use this concept here. Okay, and then 20, this radius is given. Try to find out the this radius OA in terms of AD. I have found. From here, you find out the side of the triangle. Because it is a equilateral triangle, so length of all this string is 20 root 3 centimeter each. Okay. So, hope you understood this problem also. And uh, today I am going to stop here. So, we are left only with one exercise. The exercise number 10.5 okay so here we will get some concept about the circle um, and the uh, cyclic quadrilateral okay so next day i will start okay thanks for watching